in the inner city, we see a lot of young people and families that are, um, you know, struggling. We have a, a group of youth, youth that perhaps have not been given opportunities. And they are not exposed to the arts, and we have a lot of talent. Every aspect of life needs some kind of creativity. What we're trying to do is bring the art to the neighborhood, bring the art to them. It's like um, our own wheels. We'll take it wherever um, it's needed. Deep in the inner city of St. Louis, arts education is hard to come by. Enter the Urban Canvas Artist Network, or UCAN for short, a nonprofit organization dedicated to empowering underserved youth with academic and cultural arts programming. Well, it's a um, community-based organization. We're, our mission is to really build up an alliance of artists to get out into the community and try to change that community. I want to network with other groups with like-minded interests for our youth and to make the lives of these artists uh, propel to the next level. We've been in libraries in the inner city, we've been in community centers, we've been in schools, and we're just trying to spark and empower those young people and those families to say, hey, there's a gift, there's a talent, and there's a need. The Urban Canvas Artist Network helps young artists tackle big themes and visually compelling pieces with the assistance of mentors and role models. This unique pairing of established and beginning artists is part of what makes this program so successful. You will see different styles and subject matters, a variety of different techniques, of different influences. The pieces over desire. Uh, uh, <laughs> like today's society, uh, skinny women are depicted as the most desirable and I think that shouldn't be the case because everybody is beautiful in their own way. The, the bigger painting with the pigeons that are all piled up on each other is imitating a statue in Vienna called the Pestestuhl. Or, so I was like, I want to imitate that statue but replace everything with pigeons. And so I did and I, everybody kind of just thought I was making a pile of pigeons. And I was like, no, it's actually kind of mimicking the statue. <laughs> and, um, and then I, I named it Traum von Tauben, which means the dream of pigeons in German. The exhibit you've seen today is the first of many that will call the Renaud Spirit Center home. The Urban Canvas Artist Network plans to host a yearly exhibit at the RSC showcasing the freshest work by these talented young artists. Exhibits like this are an important part of UCAN's mission and raise awareness for the program and more importantly, the artists. No matter what their future career may be, exploring the arts will always be a vital part of who they are. You could be a businessman or you could own some company, if you're not creative, with your mission or vision, chances are it'll miss that extra edge it needs to go to the next level. So stick to your creativity if you love it and uh, believe, believe in what you're doing and don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Anybody that's negative, put them to the side and surround yourself with positive people.